So hello again. Um, this is going to be a review for this new Tyrrell for me, the espresso flavor, coffee flavor. This is the, oh, there's a little coffee cup on the back. This is the premium uh, size Tyrrells and if you saw my last video I explained that there was a difference between the the premium version which is like this and the standard version which is smaller like that and definitely recommend if you can find the bigger size get the bigger size at least on the the regular one which is the only premium one I've tried so far it was much much better than the standard one or the littler one that sold in the uh, variety packs um, but before I get to this one I just wanted to show this box of speaking of variety this is the Tyrrell variety box that's currently being sold in Japan um, I'm a little bit disappointed because when I bought this they had a picture of I guess the version of this which was out right before this one and that one came with the um, let me show you it came with this one included which is the um, just the regular new chocolate nougat which I really really in, uh, enjoyed I really like that one um, this new one I guess is being put out for summer and they replaced that one with the strawberry flavor and if you've seen my videos you know I'm not that big of a fan of strawberry chocolate so yeah a little bit disappointed on that and I actually I've already opened this box but I opened it from the bottom so I wouldn't destroy the box uh, but now that I'm doing a video not really review of this but I'll just open it the right way so it has a flap like that, and a little package inside, and let's see, hold on, let me get this out. And it's a cute little package, which I kind of destroyed that. Hold on. That's in there. So that's the pa what the package looks like. Little bunny rabbits, little critters on a, either side of, I guess, a train track. I At least they're smart enough to stand on the side of it and not on it. But anyway, so inside you get 27 little, yeah, individual candies. Um, I counted, there was like five of the coffee nougat the standard one five of the strawberry five of the where is it the bis biscuit flavor and I think that's yeah I think the rest you get four each you get four of the whites four of the milks and Four of these little, I can't see that, almond flavors. So, but anyway, uh, I'll do a review at some point on the those other ones that I haven't shown yet. But the, let's get to this really quickly. So, uh, I need to open this. I don't know if I can do this. Just one hand. Yeah, I bought this off of um, Ichiba Rakuten or something like that. It's a, a site I just found a couple of weeks ago. And it's kind of like a cross between eBay and Amazon. The site itself doesn't really sell items, but they provide a... Whoa. <laughs> no, it's just that... that the smell of this chocolate just sort of hit me in the face. That is strong because I'm not like, my face isn't like right by that chocolate, but it is wafting off of there. Something powerful. Mm. And this has a different design. This is like a checkerboard. I guess you could play chess on that or something. 
But anyway, yeah, the I'll, I'll do a review of the site. I bought this on whenever I get to that. But yeah, it's and it's dark. I don't know if you can see how dark that is. It's a very dark chocolate. Well, let's try it out. Oh, yeah! Oh, wow, that is some strong tasting chocolate, and. Ooh, it has like, um, I don't know if you can even see it. Hold on. I don't know if you can see that. There's like a liquidy thing in there on the top. It's like a chocolate. Oh, my camera's just not focusing. Sorry about that. Um, it's like a cho the chocolate on the outside. Then there's like a, it's kind of glossy. Right under that, it's like a liquid center. I don't know what that is. I don't know. And then there's like, I think that's a, a different kind of chocolate underneath. But it is strong. It is definitely a very strong coffee flavor. Um, and dark chocolate. It's like a dark chocolate mixed with a strong coffee flavor. And let me see. I can't really tell which flavor was more pronounced than that. I see. Um, and it's crunchy too. I believe there were crushed up coffee beans in that. Yeah. Yeah, that is a very strong tasting candy. I don't, I, I mean, it's unique. I don't know if it's for everybody. Um, I, I think if you like really good dark chocolate and you're a coffee drinker, you, this is probably what you might consider the best of both worlds. Yeah, I'm not a coffee drinker. I do like dark chocolate, so... Um, would I buy this again? Well, to be honest, I already did, but that was before I tasted it. Um, I had to place another order, and so I just picked up some more of these, um, but uh, they haven't even come in yet. So, I would recommend it. It's definitely a premium version. It has a better quality chocolate, in it, but it is strong tasting. If you don't like really strong flavors, this probably isn't for you. I would stick to buying the premium regular version, but if you like really intense flavors, give this one a try. Uh, this was bought off Napa Japan, and like I said, this was bought off that Rakuten Ichiba, but uh, that's it for now. So this was a plus, but thank you for watching. Yeah, so here's a better example of what I was talking about. That's not melted chocolate. That's this liquid, just, you know, the natural state of this candy. There's this liquidy stuff. I really don't know what that is. If that's like a, just a coffee flavored substance or what. But yeah, I just wanted to give you a better shot of that.